What's up, guys? This is YouTube. I mean, Dark Scorpio on YouTube, obviously. Um, Sunday we went out. We, uh, the power went out, and Monday for most people, um, it snowed, and then it snowed again, and then it sleeted, and now we're going on into Wednesday, and it iced over the snow. But uh, some of it is melting. Where people have drove, driven a lot, it's there's gravel, so there's traction. But there's still a lot of snow on the. You don't want to drive in where there's heavy snow; you can get stuck. But there is ice out there, so you got to be careful. Um, the slowest I've gone is five miles an hour because I want to be safe. But uh, where I have traction, I, I, I can I pick it up to about. 20 miles an hour but still you want to be careful so there is areas as you can see where there's snow and then around that is ice so you don't want to roll over that and then slam on the brakes okay guys we want to be really careful out here um, as you can see there's ice ice around the snow so we just want to be really careful and uh, drive safely. In most areas, especially where there's ice, we want to drive uh, five miles an hour. Okay, I recommend five miles an hour, maybe 10 if you've got some traction. Now, if it's um, like this and people have driven and there's gravel and you've got traction, then a, a safe 20 miles an hour is about safe but uh, here's a uh, Hewitt Drive so HEB is open guys Walmart's closed well when I went by Walmart was closed uh, everybody's packing up at Bushes and Sonic uh, of course Taco Casa is open I know that because I used to work there um Let's just keep it. Oh, watch this. Look, somebody's rolling right now in front of me. He could have waited, but I guess he didn't want to. It's a good thing we didn't try to stop or slide into each other. Got my Boba Fett. So just be careful out here, guys. This is not something to play with. I didn't want to come out today, but we were low on food. Uh, I, I had to be the one to get out and go see if HEB was open a friend of ours was all the way in Waco and needed some diapers really bad and she didn't have any means to get any so I went ahead and did that for a friend and I'm telling you it, it's it's dangerous out here it's safer on some of the main roads where people are driven but still some of the streets in the neighborhoods are more dangerous than the main roads so you want to be careful for that i mean so everything's iced over uh we're going into win this is wednesday everything's still without power uh by tonight there's probably not gonna be any power and we're gonna be going into thursday hopefully by friday everything will be melted even if the power is not on friday will be uh, a day where things start to melt because the temperature will go back up it's supposed to so but uh, there's a lot of water on the ground, so maybe the cars and just rolling over it so much is melting it. Just want to be careful. Subscribe to my video, I mean, to my channel, like the video. Just talking about the weather here again today and letting you know what it's like to drive out here. I don't recommend driving. Stay home if you got food. Stay home as much as possible. If you have to get out, then I'm giving you advice on what to do when you get out. You drive real slow. Make sure you roll before you get to where you got to get to so you can stop. Because when you wait till all the way at the end, you're going to slide and go past that. You don't want to do that. So 
subscribe to my channel guys thanks for watching it's bad it's just gotten worse it's sleeted today and it iced over the snow the last two or three days of snow so uh broken records broken records in waco broken records in texas houston's bad without power we're without power bellmead waco woodway hewitt uh Dallas is doing okay with power. I've heard some places being turned on and off. And Oklahoma's broken records. And Arkansas, I got family in Arkansas, they broken records where they've gotten at least, uh, I think before it was nine inches and then to, today added, a, it was another 12 or 13, but probably by tomorrow they'll have at least 15, 16 inches of snow total within the last few days and i know we got about seven or eight oh probably now maybe about eight inches of snow which is a whole lot so look at all that that's ice in the middle of the road so just go five miles an hour subscribe to my channel stay tuned